Girl, if you don't stop picking this baby up, Harley prefers to rise with the sun. Harley went to bed at 3 a.m. and she woke up at 6 a.m. She's like, you know, no, I'm good. Let's wake up now. Hey everyone, it's Char. Welcome back to my channel and welcome to a brand new Let's Play. I am here with Paige and baby Harley, who are the founders of my new Growing Together Let's Play, which is centered all around the Family Dynamics Challenge. While you watch Paige interact with her beautiful daughter, Harley, I want to give you a little bit of backstory on Paige and tell you more about the Family Dynamics Challenge. So Paige is the first generation of this challenge. It is a 10 generation legacy challenge. And with Growing Together, legacy challenges just got so much more fun. This part of this LP with Paige Generation 1 is going to focus really, really heavily on family and the Growing Together expansion pack. We are living in San Sequoia. And before I tell you Paige's backstory while she teaches Harley tummy time, Harley, is a very young infant, by the way. She just aged up into an infant. Let me tell you about the Family Dynamics Challenge. So this is the Family Dynamics Challenge. It was created by Pastella Pixels and Standing Simmer. And the whole idea is family fun uh, gameplay. I'm not going to read everything to you because that would be pretty boring. It's the same basic legacy challenge rule, except of course I do play with mods. Most of my mods just make it harder, not easier. So I'm totally fine with that. And the main rule you should know is that we are allowed to use free real estate on with the first generation only, which is what I did. I am playing in a custom save. I'm playing the simply global save file. And then each career and aspiration has to be completed unless stated otherwise. We are on generation one. So white picket fence. And this is from the time that you strike out on your own as a young adult, you dream of cultivating loving familial relationships as rich and unique as the dishes you love to create. You marry younger than some of your friends, raise a bundle of children, and enjoy gardening and entertaining in your spare time. Yet you still devote a portion of your life to your hidden dream of becoming a master chef. The traits for generation one are outgoing, foodie, and family oriented. Aspiration is a successful lineage and the culinary career for the master chef branch. But at level five, if we so choose, we can start our own restaurants and leave the career. We have to complete at least five gold level dinner parties. We have to master the cooking and baking skills. We must marry as a young adult and stay happily married until death do us part. We need to have three to four children and we need to maintain a garden with at least 10 unique plants, including a cow plant. And we have to complete at least three quarters of the successful lineage aspiration. As always, I will have those challenge rules linked below, but let me introduce you to Paige. So Paige lives here in San Sequoia. Paige is a young adult. She actually just recently aged up into a young adult. She is family oriented. She's outgoing. She's a foodie. She wants to be a chef and she has a daughter named Harley. Now Paige got pregnant when she was a teenager from her high school boyfriend. Her parents are hella fucking rich and so successful, but she doesn't have a good relationship with her family. However, they did give her some money to go buy a house with her partner and they essentially said, you had this baby. So so you are going to go and live and take care of your baby. Here's money to get started. And that is about it. So she and her boyfriend, Cash, did move out when they were teenagers. They moved into this little house here and were in the process of upgrading and renovating. Cash was still in high school, obviously, but he also needed to have a part-time job. Oh my gosh, look at how freaking cute. He also needed to have a part-time job. So he worked as like a mechanic of sorts. He was in the that career with the handiness stuff. <laughs> That is where he, what he was doing. And one day while he was renovating, he unfortunately passed from being electrocuted while doing electrical renovations, electrical work, and he died. And he died when Paige was in her third trimester. So he never got to meet his daughter and Paige is very much still grieving the loss of her boyfriend. And she is trying to raise baby Harley on her own. Of course, he died while she was pregnant. So it has been some time. And Paige, when she got the money from her family because she is not close to any of them. We have her father, Rick, and we have her mother, Selena. She and her mother have a 
terrible relationship. Like her mother essentially kicked her out. She kicked her out with some money, but she did kick her out. And then her father just kind of stood by. He was pretty strict. They have good compatibility. Like they all do. They could all be a close family, but their family connection just was very, very rough. Paige also has two siblings. She has her brother, Jackson, who she has not spoken to since she moved out. She literally took the money and ran and has not spoken to anybody, even more so after losing her boyfriend. She changed her number. She just let everyone go. And then she has her other sibling, Lauren, who works as a green technician. Again, Lauren is a little bit closer in age to Paige, but she hasn't spoken to her sibling in a while. And Lauren does use they, them pronouns. So we are probably not going to see our family members. Maybe there's an opportunity for redemption somewhere down the line. But for now, it is just Paige and her beautiful baby girl, Harley. And she unfortunately knows that she's going to have to start working because this is all the money she has left in the world and as much as she would love to stay home with the baby all day right now that's not a possibility for her and Harley oh just look at her with the baby let's do a little feed for Harley I don't think she's super uncomfortable or anything like that but I do want to make sure that we feed her and we put her down for a nap and of course up oh, Harley was like, I'm not hungry. And of course, Harley doesn't know anybody but her mother. Of course, she has these family connections and relationships, but she doesn't even know her father because her father died while she was still in the womb. But I'm so excited to play this. Thanks, dead boyfriend. It was my birthday. <laughs> recently in case you're curious we do have his grave out here and this house did come with some plants we have like a basil bush we have some mushrooms but the main appeal here is that they have a pear tree in the front yard you want to eat birthday cake no 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 babes you are in fact a master chef so i'm gonna have you serve well you want to be a master chef serve a garden salad because please don't burn the kitchen down up oh, What's wrong with the baby? Oh, she's tired. All right, darling, come and put Harley here. Let's put Harley to bed. And it has been some time. Paige is very much so grieving the loss of cash. So she doesn't feel ready to be in a relationship, but just know that I will be moving towards that. Look at Harley's little outfit. Let's soothe her to sleep, please. And then we're gonna kiss goodnight. Oh, she's just staring at us. Oh, I love the little scrunches that the babies do. It's so freaking cute. Harley, you're gonna go to bed try to sleep try to go night night oh yes it did perfect all right you can Paige. you can come and resume this garden salad infectious joy from adoring someone the presence of the little one is a true bundle of joy oh she is absolutely loving being around her baby she doesn't have to join a career just yet but i will have her do that um pretty soon maybe i'll give her tomorrow with harley because harley just aged up and then she's gonna have to go into work harley our beautiful baby girl is in fact a sunny baby we'll see what her other personality traits are but she was born at home Paige did not go to the hospital to have harley and she had her first smile Paige, how did you dirty this counter so quickly oh my gosh finish your salad it was excellent quality i'm sure yes because this is a chef's lot and then i am going to have have her polish this counter to perfection and I mean she might as well purchase some seeds because she does need to maintain a garden and I do see her growing her own food so let's go shopping and as much as I would love to buy cute little baby clothes that of course would not be a priority for Paige in the moment okay let's go it's fall right now so we'll do seasonal fall plants and seasonal winter plants and then we'll just get some starter fruits and some starter veggies while Harley is taking her beautiful little nap oh Oh, we have Harley's baby print. Stop. That's so cute. By the way, this is Harley's nursery. <laughs> I think it's so adorable and so over the top. So these are Harley's tiny little handprints. How freaking cute. And this is her room, her nursery. Obviously, Paige put a ton. Hello. Obviously, Paige put a ton of work and effort into making Harley's nursery like very cute. A place where she could sit and breastfeed Harley and like have the changing table. It is 
an adorable room. I really love it. And this is Paige's bedroom. <laughs> it's just the bed. She is definitely prioritizing the baby. I'm going to have her come and cry it out while Harley is sleeping because, of course, she is going through a difficult time. Life has been hard for her since she was a teenager, arguably for longer than that because she and her parents don't have a very good relationship. Neither do she and her siblings. But let me go and plant our veggies. And I do want our garden to be over here because I want a tree house over here. We have an apple tree which i will pop two of those over there i'll sell the rest we have onions great you can go with the carrots and then we got some beautiful flowers which i think will be lovely in our front yard so i'm gonna have Paige come and plant while we take care of this and yes our our partner's grape will just always be by this tree she's like going back and forth between her emotions like sad because she lost her husband or sad because she lost her boyfriend but also happy because she has a baby so she <laughs> she is very all over the place right now fantastic the rain can water my plants and she is super tired which means we're going to have to transfer harley which means harley will wake up but she would not leave harley downstairs while she went to sleep upstairs so let's quietly transfer her to her room i mean she's gonna need a diaper change and a feed anyway yep she we woke her up <laughs> all right well let's have you breastfeed baby harley and then she's gonna need a diaper change no pick her up you have to feed her there we go stop putting her down there we go all right harley is having her dinner then we need to come and change her diaper and then we need to put harley to sleep just look at how she looks at her baby it is so stinking cute oh she spit up this is honestly the cutest pack so far i played with it a little bit before um in my whimsy stories challenge lily is my gen one sim and she has twin boys so i've gotten a chance to play with the pack i think infants are the cutest freaking thing ever i'm so glad we have them in the game it's harley's first diaper change as an infant they get her kicking her little feet oh my gosh i cannot it is so freaking cute all right harley back to sleep sweetie let's go to bed use diaper harley i just changed you put her down she was already down no 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 she was gonna go downstairs and put her back downstairs you leave harley in her crib okay let's soothe her to stop picking her up stop it there's still sims at the end of the day you know Harley's already down there. Let's soothe her to sleep. She hasn't used her diaper yet. She will. So we'll have a diaper change uh, very early in the morning because it's literally 2 a.m. Yes, yes. Mommy is taking care of you. Hello, Harley. Go to bed, sweetie. Is she going to go to sleep? They look like they're glitched. Try to go night night. Yes, please do. Oh my God. Girl, if you don't stop picking this baby up, put Harley to sleep now. Harley's no. This is the reality of being a sim. True. Truly. She's stuck in a perpetual loop of picking up the baby. Put Harley to bed. Look, she's crying. Change your diaper. All right, and then let's try this again. Put Harley to bed. Okay, leave her there. Quickly, leave. Because <laughs> she is going to pick her. You know, it's hard, but Paige is going to walk away from Harley. And then if Harley doesn't naturally soothe herself to sleep, she'll come back and try to do that. Look at her. The cutie pie. There we go. She has soothed herself to sleep and Mama is off to bed. Early riser, Harley prefers to rise with the sun oh my gosh oh my goodness hartley went to bed at 3 a.m and she woke up at 6 a.m she's like yeah no i'm good let's wake up now all right all right let us feed her we love having an early riser baby harley is like i don't want to hear a story mom i want to get fed let's give her a cuddle Aw, she's cooing. Give her a cuddle. How freaking cute. You want to check her? You want to feed her? You know, she's exhausted, but she does have a baby and she is a single parent. So it's just her that has to look, look after Harley and Harley's needs. No, I didn't tell you to put Harley down there. I told you to feed her. <laughs> I honestly love Paige already. She's like, don't tell me how to raise my baby. I know what she wants. She wants to be picked up and put down infinitely. <laughs> there we go. She's getting her breakfast. Mom is also going to need to have her breakfast. Harley is literally about to pee her little diaper. So we are going to change Harley's outfit. Honestly, let's get her ready for the day. You know, it might be fun to take Harley out for a little walk today, but let's just get her taken care of for the morning. Cause it's still way too early and she is going to need to take a nap very soon. Paige is so stubborn, I swear to you. <laughs> she is just like, I'm gonna do whatever I want. Let's change Hardy's little outfit.
outfit, please. She is literally about to pee her pants just as I put her down. I know it. Where are you going to do that? In the rocking chair. Oh my gosh, that's going to be so stinking cute. Harley's like, eh, what are you crying about? Oh, she doesn't like peekaboo. Harley's a stubborn little baby. At this point, we're just waiting for her to use her diaper so that we can give her a change. Let's give her a cuddle. Let's give her a kiss. Wow, Harley is just not liking anything that Paige does. But she absolutely adores her daughter. <laughs> Even if Harley's like, no, no, this is the cutest thing ever. Oh my gosh, this is so freaking precious. You know, I just want to get a screenshot of this. All right, Harley has finally used her diaper. She is fed and changed and all better. And as much as she was protesting, she did find that bounce very soothing and she feels very loved from all of the affection her mother has showered on her. Kiss goodnight and then leave Harley alone because you have to take a shower. You need to come and sleep with Harley while she naps. All right, Harley, go night night. How dare you put me down. The warmth and comfort is absent and now it feels like the end of the world. It's not Harley. You'll be fine. I know you're tired. You're in bed already. And off to sleep she does go. Hey, just like, I've got to finish taking this shower and I need to go to bed. And then when Harley is up, I need to make sure that I eat lunch and then we got to go on a walk. But look at how beautiful San Sequoia is in the fall. Like, wow, this is so pretty. Up and at him, Paige. Use that bathroom. Harley's needs. Harley is super hungry. Or she will be. That's okay. You still have plenty of time to come and use the bathroom. She is so sad from losing a loved one. It is very hard right now. What I am going to do, though, is put Harley down here so that Paige can have some lunch. A very late lunch. It's 5 p.m. She's going to have something quick. Actually, just get leftovers. And then I want us to go for a little sunset walk. She came all the way to the fridge to get the salad. Before she's like, oh yeah, I gotta pick Carly up. All right. I was gonna have Paige eat first because she is breastfeeding. So obviously she's going to need to keep her energy up. But Harley is super hungry right now. So I'm going to give her a feed, which means we might not even have time to do our walk. Okay, I know that Paige is super hungry, but I do want to send her on a walk with Harley. So let me just have her change her outfit. It's pretty warm. She can wear her every day. Let us. Yeah, don't put her down. I didn't tell you to do that. Let's travel with Harley, obviously. Paige's needs are too low because she's hungry. That doesn't make any damn sense. All right, well, we're at the community center. There is a little lunch thing here. So let's have her serve. Mm, have a quick meal, babes. Come have a ham and cheese sandwich. Harley, are you not enjoying your beautiful walk? You are. You're enjoying being carried. It is getting dark, so it will be a sunset walk, but that's okay. Paige's needs should be good now. She can have a wonderful reflective walk around the Arboretum, which should help her with all that's happened in her life. Oh, that she's walking with the baby and with her sandwich. We're on our reflective walk very soon. Harley is super tired, but don't worry, Harley. You can go to sleep. I wish I could follow her and stay in tab mode. Don't worry. You're going to go to sleep. Mommy is taking you on this beautiful walk at this lovely golden hour while she focuses her energy and you're going to take a nap in your little carrier and i'm loving the walk for her no don't take harley out of back carrier she's like i can't i can't go for the walk while baby's crying well let's give harley a nap here in the middle of the road at 9 p.m <laughs> we're just gonna sit here and rock her for a while and while she's doing that i'll have her call a cat we're going back home or harley's sleep schedule is gonna be so off but it's fine it's fine we're adapting all right we are home so we might as well come and put harley down here so we can do a little bit of tummy time and of course harley is happy because she woke up in her mother's arms she's lifting her head oh that's so cute she hates tummy time but it's okay harley you need to do it i just love it let's comfort her and then she is going to need a feed she's taking a picture of harley's first milestone of holding her head up that is so freaking cute let's give her a feed that is the cutest animation that she's just like taking pictures and harley starts giggling and laughing because she likes having her photo taken it is so cute my pride and joy Paige can't believe how much her little one has accomplished in such little time and she's feeling closely connected with her daughter then she'll need a new diaper and we'll put her right back to sleep oh she'll need her first bath we can go do that now we've been out all day she was in the back carrier so we're gonna give her a bath Paige has reached parenting level two well her Harley will need a new diaper, but let's give Harley a nice bath, not a bubble bath, because we want her to be relaxed before bed. Oh, she wants to catch up with her sibling, Lauren. Interesting. For now, we focus on baby. Let's see Harley's first bath. 
stuff. Oh my gosh, so cute. And I think the sponge is even shaped like something. First bath milestone. All right, let's go upstairs and let's put Harley here. Let's change her outfit because it's time for her to go to bed. It's 2 a.m. Great times. We're going to put Harley to bed and then Paige, you will also go to bed immediately. Good night. Let me auto light Harley's room too. Don't worry, Harley will self-soothe herself to sleep. And when we look at that, Paige actually managed to sleep until her sleep bar was full. She is still feeling really sad. You're hungry, but guess who else is hungry? It's baby Harley. Let's give her a feed. I love that it was in her first menu. She already knew. She's like, yeah, I gotta come and feed the baby. And we're gonna talk to Harley. We're gonna give her a bounce. We'll start off with some morning tummy times. And then I will have, eventually, I'll cue Paige up to go and serve up some dinner. <laughs> I just love how they roll them over. Look at how freaking cute this is. Paige is just like, Harley's fine. I'm gonna go and have some breakfast really really quick. Let's serve up some eggs and toast. Don't burn the kitchen down. Oh, she blew out her diaper. All right. All right. Don't worry. Your mommy is coming. Let's change Harley's diaper, please. And let's change her outfit. Let's get it a pretty nice day. We'll just keep her in her everyday wear. Okay. We don't have to worry about changing her diaper three times. Oh my goodness. Let's just give her a bath. We can give her a bubble bath. I know the carpet is very lush and beautiful, but we've just got to give her a bath. See, all you did was put poop all over her new outfit. Poor Paige, I feel like she is struggling. I mean, she, obviously she loves her daughter and she's having a great time like being a mother. It feels a lot of fulfillment in that. But she doesn't have any time to take care of her needs. She's like, I'm really hungry, really, really hungry. And I also need a shower, but we need to do tummy time with Harley and we've got to finish breakfast and do all of the things. All right, this bath has literally taken all morning. Harley's clean. Paige, you can resume your eggs and toast. Harley, you're gonna need another diaper. The animation glitched. Okay, honestly, I feel like that's because MC Command Center might be glitching. Poor Paige. Honestly, she hasn't left her house at all. Harley is a little handful. Love her so much, but she is definitely a little handful. All right, Paige, this is your chance. You could finally have yourself some breakfast. Then you are gonna need... Oh, Harley's sleeping. We'll let her finish her nap. Which which is perfect timing for Paige because then you can come and have a shower while Harley sleeps. And then I'm gonna have her join the culinary career because it is time, which means Harley will eventually start going to daycare. All right, let's go be a chef. She's gonna start as an assistant dishwasher. She's gonna take that shower. She's like, okay, this is my chance. This is my moment. I can take care of my needs. Then I have to give change Harley's diaper and Harley's going to be hungry and we have to do tummy time. Harley for now is still asleep. I don't want her sleep schedule to be too thrown off though, but this is kind of a blessing. So Paige, you can serve up some lunch and hopefully keep that in the fridge for a little while because that's going to be the food that's going to be available to you while you are working and taking care of Harley. She kind of has to use the bathroom and honestly, she rarely ever gets a chance to do anything before Harley wakes up in a moment. So she's going to be like, ah, I'm going to just take care of all of my needs, make sure I am as full and as happy as possible. Fabulous. Her needs are fantastic. So let's go and change Harley diaper and we're gonna try to keep her on a schedule before this episode ends i would love to get harley on a more normal sleeping schedule you know she's still coming out of that newborn stage she can't fully distinguish between day and night but now she's definitely a little bit older so hopefully she should be able to we're gonna change her diaper she's very angry because she is awake yeah because her mom won't go up early yes harley stop fussing mommy's gonna change your diaper oh just right there on the floor. Let's give her a cuddle then. And she also wants a feed. So we're going to give her a breastfeed too. Oh, she's bottle feeding her. Okay, cool. Oh, just spit up all over her mom. Adorable. Let's put Harley in a back carrier so we can go for a jog. Now, Paige does spend a lot of time at home, but she wants to make sure that Harley gets plenty of fresh air. And here's something that I love with the pack, obviously, because the back carrier is part of that. You can put the baby in the carrier and then send your Sims on a jog and they're all jogging with the baby. Look at how stinking cute that is. Look at this beautiful walk. I would take a screenshot, but Paige is too busy frowning at us. But look at Harley. She's just bouncing away in her carrier. Santa Coya is such a beautiful world. She dislikes fitness. Fine. Okay, don't put Harley in the middle of the street. I know you're a sim and you love doing that, 
but let's instead put Harley down on her little mat. You're gonna put her down underneath the couch. Oh my gosh. How many time together? Let's see if we can unlock the rollover milestone. Paige was like, well, my needs were good. And then you set me on a jog and now I stink. And I know Harley is tired, but I want to keep her awake until like 8.30. So she sleeps through the night. Can you believe we're already halfway through Harley's age span? Come on, Harley. You could unlock the milestone. I know you're sleepy, but don't worry. Bedtime is in like 10 minutes. We're finally going to get you on a normal sleeping schedule, which I'm sure Paige is going to be so grateful for. The home is looking so much fuller. Yes, the space. Oh, she rolled over to her back. That is so cute. Okay, anyway, put Harley to bed, please. Let's get her on a normal sleep schedule she is overtired now but don't worry we're gonna soothe her straight to bed don't try to go night night yet mommy's gonna put you in your crib she's gonna need a little soothe to sleep just because she is so so tired almost none of these things count as interacting with our child i mean we are interacting with her okay she's finally happy she might send herself off to sleep Paige is just gonna watch her and make sure that happens and by 9 p.m little harley is in bed Paige is going to go and finally <laughs> she's like i've got to take a shower i need to eat dinner and she needs to go to bed because in the morning she's gonna have her first day of work i'm gonna keep this light on in her room it's like a little pink night light because i think that's cute finally some rest and relaxation for myself because being a single mom is really fucking hard she barely has time to take care of her own needs. All right, Paige, come and get some leftovers. And then let's go to sleep before Harley wakes up. Hopefully she sleeps through the night, but we shall have to wait and see. I'm going to leave it here on baby Harley in her little crib because this is the Growing Together Let's Play. Thank you so much for watching this episode. Let me know uh, what you think. If you're excited for the series, I know that I'm very excited to play with the page and see where her family goes. Obviously, I'm going to focus on getting her into her next relationship because she is supposed to marry young and I'll see you in the next part. Bye. Bye.